Hello, I got a quick update here from the Twin Cities, Minnesota. I'm under a bridge in the suburbs, just north of Minneapolis in St. Paul, Minnesota. I'm checking out the streams because the streams, the creeks, the rivers, in my opinion, are all man-made. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. All right? Yes, they are. And I see too much, I see way too much evidence supporting the idea that all of these, all of these rivers, streams, creeks that run through major cities and pretty much everywhere else, not all of them, but most of them, are man made. Absolutely, they are. Absolutely, they are. And I'm going to provide evidence and proof towards this claim in the next coming weeks because I have tons of evidence to provide and um, different waterways, streams, rivers, the Mississippi that I've been looking at and observing and examining. Here's some melt right here. Here's some melt right here. Look at that big melted glob sitting right there of pebble crete and iron and such. There's iron in there, crete. Hard to say, was it just metal? Was it just metal or was it masonry? Because I've seen and I've showed before just recently that masonry or that metal can blow out like this as well. And this appears to be just iron, but blown out iron. Again, it's, yeah, listen to it. That's this metal. And look what happens to the metal. It blows out. That's metal, 100%. It's, it's melted metal. And look what happens to it. It blows out and the minerals blow out into bigger minerals. They expand out. Holy smokes, right? Yeah, holy smokes. So, it smells like fish down here. Lovely smell, eh? Holy smokes. But, let me show you what's going on here with this, with this creek. So, first of all, let me take your attention to this. Here's where the anomalies begin. And think about this carefully. How'd that get there? How'd that get there? It's iron, how'd that get there? Big chunk of heavy iron. Now, likely, you may say, well, maybe there was a bridge here previously. Okay, yes. So that would put a bridge here in the past. Um, okay, good enough. Uh, still, anomalous, why that's sitting right there, why, why they didn't clean it up. Uh, next, more iron. It didn't float down river, it didn't float downstream. How'd that get there? A previous bridge? Well, it could be. Um, it could be. But I do know that this bridge has been here quite some time. It has not been repaired since I've, since I've um, been around, so 30-something years. And if there was a bridge previously here, this iron right here is not rusting whatsoever, sitting in the water, nor is that over there. So it appears to be that good old world iron that, that, that does not rust, okay? So if there was a bridge here, it was likely an old world bridge. And I'm sure there was probably a bridge here. And that may be why all these man-made materials are sitting in the, in the stream here. But not only that, I said that I think these streams and these rivers and the creeks are man-made. Yes, I do. And what kind of evidence might I have to support that claim? Here's the edge of the canal wall here, the stream, the stream wall still remaining. It's very damaged and blown out, but it still remains. The edge of the actual canal still remains here. Here's the bridge wall here. Here's the original canal wall or border. And watch this. So there's stones. So it's right here. Follow it. And boom, it disappears underneath all the rubble on top. How do all, these, how do all this rubble here get on top this, these big heavy boulders get on top of this wall here. Did the workers who may have put this bridge here, who knows how long ago, have done this and made this mess? I don't think so. Maybe they did. Maybe they did. I don't know. Um, but here's something else. So we got this strange, that's, that's the wall, baby. That's the, it's, they're man-made. They're not natural. These aren't river rocks either. You thought, you thought these were river rocks, right? No. No, uh uh uh. 
Hang on a minute. No, that's pebble crete. So what is a masonry material doing sitting here, a big glob of it, sitting here in the middle of the stream on top of the canal wall here? On top of the canal wall. Here's the wall, the old wall. And it disappears and there's pebble crete on top, big chunks of pebble crete. How do these big heavy chunks get on top of this wall here? How long have they been here? How long have they been on top of this wall here, hiding this wall, the original wall here? I would guess these seem to have been here for a while, eh? I don't know, maybe not. But maybe so. These are, these are masonry. That's Pebble Crete. That's Pebble Crete. It looks like concrete. It could have been concrete. It could have been brick. Any masonry material, any metal can blow out into Pebble Crete. Pebble Crete. That's Pebble Crete. These are Pebble Cretes. Okay? Pebbly Cretes. Not river rocks. Not river rocks. Okay? That's masonry. All of it is. So I'm guessing that these are all the canal, the canal uh, itself, just all blown out, jumbled up. Maybe the, the waterways were way more important in the past civilization because it seems that they took quite a hit. All the waterways seem to have taken quite a hit. And they're blown out. All the masonry is lying in rubble, ruins, inside of the streams causing causing rapids to form and such which i don't think was the idea to have all these rapids at least not everywhere and i'm not convinced that these are natural whatsoever not when i see bricks and i see you know flat surfaces and concrete and pebble crete flat surfaces and uh you know flat concrete surfaces on these so-called river rocks and iron that did not float down a river, indicating that there was possibly an older bridge here, an already existing bridge here. They've covered this up, all of these, which is limestone underneath, and we know what limestone is, so there was a bridge here, there was a bridge here. All this limestone, they're covering up with what? Concrete. Why? Because there's likely bricks sticking out everywhere in that shit. All in this stuff here, probably bricks sticking out of it everywhere and they wanted to be able to walk on this stuff likely oh look at this the bridge goes down below all of this stuff here the bridge is old the bridge is old it's been here for a while it may be an old bridge look at here in this little den be beautiful spider webs in there but yeah look at the bridge goes disappears way down into all this when do they bring all this material in here and then when did they, after that, when did they then put the concrete on top of all this material? Because the concrete looks quite old, weathered, cracking away, likely done after the fact, turn of the century. So this bridge here seems to be an old bridge as well. And it seems to have had, it seems to have been covered with, yeah, up right to there, right to there, with this white stucco. And there's the, original, there's the original rendering right here. Smooth as glass, that old world rendering. So we just found an old bridge here. We likely just found an old bridge here. <laughs> See? They rendered, they rendered just to, to, to that point right here. All this stucco, and it ends right there. Now it's just a regular, perfectly crisp, smooth as glass, that really good concrete that they use, cement, cement or whatever, rendering. Holy smokes. <laughs> See, I thought there was something strange here when I saw this big iron wall right there. We don't make iron walls. And that's ground level up on top of it. We, we don't make iron walls today, you know? So, holy smokes. Yeah, if you're gonna tell me that they put all this material in here. Now, let me back out. All this, and it's limestone, you can see, which is, we know what limestone is. And they poured all this concrete over it. And look how old the concrete looks, how weathered and how old it looks, and how it's just crumbling away. This bridge was here. <laughs> Holy smokes. So it's likely a brick bridge. It's likely brick behind all this behind all this concrete work. I don't know. I just don't see this happening anytime recent. You see what I mean? I don't see it happening anytime recently. 
No. Look at the lichen growing all around it. All the lichen on the bridge and on the concrete. There's lichen on the concrete, even. Okay. And oh, what's this here? Son of a bitch. More canal walls sticking out of the fucking ground here. Disappearing into the ground and coming right out right to there. They're not, they're not natural, y'all. These aren't natural. No, they're not. Look at the big flat pieces in here. Okay. Sorry, but this is my first time down here looking at this stuff, so first time for everyone here. Um, oh, what's this over here? So I'm gonna start walking back towards the car and I'm gonna, and geez, the deer have been down here scraping the hell out of this thing. Okay. I see something over here, what's that white thing? And look at the stone. You think it's a stone, right? But look at that. Look at perfect size of a brick. That's brick width right there. Interesting. More pebble crete. Big chunk of globby pebble crete. And just a mess in here. Okay. Yeah, this is masonry. Look. Give me a break. And what's this here? This is why I came over here. Oh my God, it is. What is that material? I don't even know what that material is. It's a pipe though, and it's completely destroyed. It's just barely peeking out. It's not terracotta, it's like a plastic. But it's like not like your normal plastic. What is that doing buried way in there? It is like a plastic though. It is like a plastic. But how that, I mean, how long has that been there? Buried like that, I mean, where's the material coming from to bury this, you know? Where's all the material coming from the bury it? I, I, don't, I don't get it. But anywho, I think that's good. It's a good place to end it. This is likely, I, I don't know, I, I would guess likely just trash from, you know, those turn of the century, those turn of the century folks who were cleaning up and stuccoing bridges and such and whatever, what have you. What's this? Is that more melt? Hang on. It is. Oh my God, it's a big piece of metal. Oh my God. Okay, how about this to end it? This is how pants on the ground is gonna end it. You get ready for this? How about that for some melt, eh? No, this is coming with me. You know what, that's coming with me. I love you all, take care.